Tools for Transformation, davidplinelovett.com. I'm so excited. Today we're going to talk about goal setting. I know it's a huge, huge subject, so let's get right to it. First of all, goal setting is one of the most efficient ways of getting things done, of having your dreams, of being able to do, be, and have whatever you desire, whatever your purpose is to be here in life. To begin with, with a goal, with your dream, you start with your why. Why do I want this goal? Do I just because or for no reason? Specifically, I want to help people. I want people to be able to live their dreams. I want there to be less or no mass shootings anymore or woman abuse or child abuse. I don't want a single person in my city to go hungry. What is your why? Why do you want it? I want to have an amazing relationship to inspire others to have amazing relationships. So I'll have a life that's running on all cylinders so I can help more others more effectively and efficiently and contribute more. What is your why? You also need to know where you're starting from and where you're ending. Your GPS will ask you. It needs to know where you are so it can get you to where you're going. If I'm going from Los Angeles to New York, I need to know that I'm in Los Angeles to start with. Now, here's a point you may not hear that often. I hope it's something new to you. To really achieve your goals, you need to clear a space. If I'm looking for a new relationship, I can't be in my old relationship. If I'm looking for a new job or career, I can't be in my old one. At least mentally, I need to be out of it so I can clear a space so that the universe will create a vacuum and it'll always fill that vacuum. Always. So I need to clear an open space so there's that availability for something new. That just means get anything out of the way. If it's your past, just move it back into the past where it belongs so that you can have a clear availability for your goals, for your dreams. Your dreams need to be specific. Uh, in 1981 uh, Management Review, George Dorian coined the acronym SMART for goals, a SMART goal. And the first part of the acronym is S for specific. Make it very specific what you want. The best example I have is my last car. I did some research. I decided based on the economics that I wanted, you know, the mileage, the price. I wanted a car that was prestigious, sporty, and economical. There weren't that many that really had all that criteria. I was able to narrow it down to exactly the car that I wanted. So you can do the same thing with your goal. Make it very specific. I want to feed this many people in this neighborhood or this city. I want there to be a third less shootings in the city that I live in. It needs to be something that you really are emotional about, something you can think about all the time. I want that goal. I want this, this dream. When I was in high school, I wanted to be most athletic, so I thought about it all the time. I had a desire to win it. I was able to visualize the person who won the award last year and replace uh, Bill with myself. I thought about it all the time. Think about the lives you're going to touch, the people you're going to contribute to with desire. Doran says, make it measurable, the M. 
SM, measurable, so you can see your progress. If I'm going from LA to New York, am I in Phoenix? Am, am I on my way? Am I making progress? And that'll help you while you keep thinking about it, you'll have the desire. When you have your goal, share it. There's something magical that happens when you share. My goal is to have the love of my life. My goal is to increase my business by 50% so that I can give 80% of my income away. There's actually people that do that. So make it in where you keep sharing it. There's something magical that happens where you start to own that goal. As others see you achieving that goal, their thinking of you, their anticipation of you actually comes back to you. And that realization, the knowing that it's going to happen, that where you step into it will rise and you'll step into that. So share is very important. Specific, measurable, know your why, clear a space, think about it all the time. Make it ambitious. Don't increase your income by 10%. Make it 30%. Don't just make it, oh, I want to have a relationship. I want to have the greatest relationship ever. Oh, I don't want to just get any old car. I want to get one that's perfectly clean. That I don't have to do a thing to when I buy it. I want to know that I saved 14 people from a mass shooting that didn't occur on my watch. I want to see 50% more people have meals every day in my community. I want women to have a place to go and people to talk to and a relief and to not be abused by 50% within a year from today. That is ambitious, that is measurable, that is specific. <coughs> and that goes to the R in relevant. Make it something that matters, not just to you, but for others. Make it relevant so it makes sense, so it serves a purpose. And not only, the, another idea is to register, to, to actually, if, if, you, if your goal is to lose weight, what better way would be to register in a gym or a weight loss program? To set a calendar date when that program is going to be and book a room. Then you're going to prepare your talk or your speech. What if you booked a hotel into the future for you and your future relationship to go to Acapulco one year from today or six months to today? And you book that room, that flight, that vacation for you and your future future relationship, a person you may not even have met yet. You feel the power in that? And the last is T, time bound. Just like I said, make it, make that date so you can specifically know when that target is. And the very last is to start. Take that first step. A journey of a thousand miles begin with the first step. So take that step. I know this has been a lot in a very short period of time, but what is your why? Where are you starting from? Where are you going? Create a space for it, a clearing. Think about it all the time. Desire it. Make it specific. Make it measurable. Make it big and ambitious. Share it. Register into it. Make it relevant. Make it something that matters. 
make it time bound, and take that first step. This is David Klein Lovett, Tools for Transformation. Have a great day and make your goals and your dreams matter. Make them relevant. Make them happen. Change the world.